everyone, welcome back to Let's Talk Tayana, all things hair and fitness related. Today I have another good episode of another DIY for you all. This is gonna be the aloe vera oil treatment. Yeah, aloe vera oil treatment. <laughs> This is supposed to help your hair grow, but it also helps prevent damage as well. This is me moving into the more of the, you know, grow your hair series. So we're moving into the grow your hair series. So this will be one. This will be video one for the grow your hair series. Last week it was avocados. This week is aloe vera and a little bit of castor oil. Um, so yes, this is gonna be our hot oil treatment to help our hair grow. And yes, everyone knows that stimulating the scalp is what's gonna also promote hair growth if you're having a hard time growing. So. Without further ado, make sure that you all like, subscribe, all that good stuff. If you are loving the content that I'm producing, I'm so excited to get this started, so let's not make this too long, okay? Let go. So starting off, you're obviously gonna need one aloe vera plant. <laughs> you can get this from your local Whole Foods or Publix or anything like that. I think they're only like a dollar. Uh, but yes, be really, really careful when cutting this. It is super slippery and it is super duper like pokey on the edges and it will cut you. So be careful. Um, there's no specific way that I try to cut it. I just wanted to get those edges off first just so I wouldn't poke myself. And then I just kind of sliced it down the middle just to get to the gel. A lot of people just will cut this in half and actually just like take the pieces and rub it to their scalp. I've seen so many videos with the aloe vera and the castor oil. Um, hot oil treatment. Um, however, I did mine a little differently. I just wanted to go ahead and take all that jelly inside the actual aloe vera gel and like scoop it out. I thought that this would be a smarter idea, but you'll see later on that it was actually not. So I would highly suggest to just leave it on the plant and rub it on your scalp with the plant just so you can have a grip on it because this stuff is super duper slippery. Aloe vera contains proteolytic enzymes, which repairs dead skin cells on the scalp. It also acts as a conditioner and leaves your hair super smooth and shiny. Um, aloe vera also promotes hair growth, prevents itchy scalp, um, reduces dandruff, all while conditioning your hair. So this stuff is really, really good. Moving along, we're gonna be using two to three tablespoons of coconut oil. This stuff is also really good for hair growth. Coconut oil is rich in antimicrobial properties, lurk acids, fatty acid that all strengthen your hair. So it conditions your scalp, help regrowth, also keeps your hair shiny. You're also going to need two to three tablespoons of black castor oil. Now this, this right here is the truth. This is what's really, really going to help stimulate that scalp and promote the hair growth that we're trying to get to get to that longer, thicker, fuller hair. After we're done mixing it all up, we're gonna sit that in that hot water. I microwaved it for about three minutes to five minutes. Um, however, we're gonna let it sit there for about two to five minutes, um, just to kind of really make sure that the oil is heated up. When we put it on our scalp, we want it to be warm so it can definitely penetrate the scalp. So we're just gonna shake it up a little bit. You'll see that it's disintegrated and you're gonna put it in this little tube. I just had one. I mean, it just really helps when you're applying the oil to your scalp to have that little tube that you can just put directly on your scalp but you don't have to have it. You can do it the old school way, whatever works best for you. Before I do anything, you wanna make sure that your hair is freshly washed and detangled. This is the jelly stuff. Oh my gosh, playing with this was <laughs> ridiculous, ridiculous. I promise y'all, y'all gonna be like, what am I doing right now? Is this even worth it? But I promise you, it is so worth it. So yes, you wanna start off by putting the aloe vera all over your scalp. Um, honestly, I'm not gonna lie, I just put this all over my head. Like I drenched my hair in this aloe vera, like from root to mid shaft, I, I promise you. And honestly, when it came to putting the oil, I put it like everywhere, but you really, really, really wanna concentrate on the scalp because that is where the conditioning properties are needed. That is what's gonna help promote the hair growth. <laughs> and that is what's gonna help us grow our hair longer because that is the goal. After applying the aloe vera gel, you wanna make sure that you go ahead and Add the coconut oil mixture and massage your head for 10 minutes and then go to sleep overnight and wake up and voila. So the end of this video, this is what my hair turned out to look like. Um, it is 75% dry, I think. Yeah. 75% dry. So this is what it turned out to look like. Um, I definitely felt my scalp like refresh itself so yes definitely try the aloe vera gel mask tell me how it works for you within the next couple of months if you continuously do hot oil treatments your hair will grow a little bit faster just a little bit but yes this is the final look so it'll be dry hopefully 
you know how long that takes i don't want to put any um heat to it just because i just did a mask so i'm just gonna let it air dry but yes this is the final result. Um, if you do like more videos like this, make sure that you comment below. Give me a thumbs up. And I'll see y'all here back with Let's Talk Tiana.